freaking hard. Suck at this shit. Suck at this shit. So bad. Okay. All right. If you're watching this video, you probably want to create a web series or a short film, and you don't know where to start. Well, my friends, you've came to the right place. My name is Yubi. Like you be helping you out, cause you be making some money real soon with that ish. Ta -ta -ta. Cue that in. Uh, so, my name is Yubi, I am 27 years old, I am based in LA, and I am the writer, creator, producer, director, cinematographer. I'm so humble. And I did El Rancho, which is a 13 episode web series, which I converted into a film, believe it or not. And that is currently on my YouTube channel right now. So with this video, I wanna to talk to you guys a little bit about my process, about the behind the scenes of creating this thing that I did in Mexico. So everything started in March when COVID hit and I didn't wanna to go to Mexico, but my parents pressured me to go to Mexico to just stay safe because we didn't know what was gonna happen, right? Everybody was going crazy, bulk shopping. And I said, okay, fine, I'll go. And I took my camera, I took one wig, I took a microphone and I was like, okay, great. The first month that I was in Mexico, I did absolutely nothing. I was bored out of my mind. And it wasn't until the second month that I said, you know what? My parents live in a ranch. I'm in the middle of nowhere in a ranch in Mexico and I have all of these great resources because it's a community ranch. So there's about four homes that are abandoned and these homes, there's nobody living in them and they're beautiful homes. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna do something with this. I had no idea what I wanted to do, right? And I just picked up my camera one day and I decided to dress up as my dad. So I dressed up as my dad I put on his hat and I was just trying to make my mom laugh. And before you knew it, I'm like, you know what? I'm going to do a skit. What happens to people when they go to Mexico? They get sick from the water, right? So I was like, okay, so UB maybe gets, I get sick and I'm going to play my dad. And I was just having fun with it. And that one episode all of a sudden gave me that idea of like, you know what? I could do something with this. So from then on, I decided, you know what, this could be like a story built. So all of the episodes are really shot out of order. And the way I wrote it was actually through an outline. I kind of used my notes on my computer and I just had ideas and I just kind of wrote things out. I didn't write dialogue. I just kind of wrote ideas or kind of like the structure of what was supposed to go on. And there are many times when I was just trying to improv and do something and that just led to a new idea. And before you know it, I had something going on. Um, I lost my train of thought. Dang it. Okay. Uh, shit. I suck at this shit. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Um, uh, yeah. So yeah, uh, that, okay, so that's where you start. So if, you, if you're thinking about starting a short film or a web series, you first have to come up with an idea, right? Um, another thing that I could say that helps is if you have a space. Say your parents have a farm or you live in a mansion, right? What characters can you create or what story format can you use the space for uh, so the space can actually inspire the idea? And from there, you can you begin an outline. I think an outline is super important. Uh, fuck, I lost my train of thought again. An outline. This video is too long. I need to start from the beginning. This sucks. Uh, uh. Hi guys. So. Hello, everybody. <laughs> I I have been at this video for the longest time, and I kept fucking up. And I'm like, you know what? For some reason, when I'm live streaming or when I'm um, uh, live, right? I I I, I there, a light comes on. 
a light comes on and I'm just ready, you know? But for some reason with the freaking camera, I can't do that shit. It's like I need your guys' energy, you know? You guys, like, hype me up. So, uh, that actually was the best take that I've taken out of the 50 takes that I've taken. It was all, like, hi, I'm Yubi, and it's just, I feel so stupid just talking to myself. And I, I feel like less stupid here on, on Periscope. I know, thank you. Give me that energy, dude. I need it. I, I need it. Um, yeah, so I'm trying to do like a behind the scenes of uh, El Rancho. My YouTube channel is YubiTube, Y-U-B-I-T-U-B-E. -E. And yeah, so this is the process, people. This is what I do. I am just over here. I need hype man. I'll take a hype man any day. Um, estoy hablando de mi proceso de cuando hice mi película El Rancho, que está en YouTube, y pues la gente quiere saber cómo hice todo el proceso. Uh, I know, right? Oh, thank you, Daniel. Thank you. I appreciate that. I needed that boost. I am. I am your favorite periscope girl. Okay, so what did, where did I leave off of? Outline. Okay, so outline. First, you need an idea, you create the outline. Um, okay, so I did this entire series by myself. So if I could do it, you could do it, right? And I know there's a lot of us who sometimes feel like, you know, you're not good enough or uh, you just have no ideas, you know? And I, I think what I could say with that is like, if you're thinking about it too much, you're already fucking up. Like, you're not gonna do it. You just have to stop thinking and do it. There were so many days where I would procrastinate and I'd be filming, and it's so stupid. You feel so stupid. I literally am talking to myself as I'm filming, and I'm trying to just set up the camera as best as possible. I have no idea what I'm doing. My sound quality is shit. Everything was like, the, the lighting, I had so many lighting issues, I kept forgetting things, but I think it's just like the action that you take towards thing, things that will help you thrive. And then not only that, also, here in LA, um, you, I, have, I would have more resources as far as people who know what the heck they're doing as friends, like filming. In Mexico, it was just me, myself, and I. Like, I couldn't call somebody up and be like, hey, yo, Maria, like, can you come over? I know you're cleaning my mom's house, but can you help me film? Like, no, Maria wants to stay and do her cleaning, you know? So it's just very, um... <sighs> uh, I hate this shit. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay. <laughs> Hello. I'm trying. I'm probably gonna cut that out. <laughs> I'm still shy. I'm shy with the camera. Like, I'm not shy on Periscope. I'm just shy with the freaking camera. It, it just got really hot. Like, I just, I just got really freaking hot. Like, you know what? F this thing. I'm doing a room tour. I'm, I'm gonna do it in Spanish. Hola amigos y amigas, yo me llamo Yubi y aquí voy a explicarles a ustedes cómo hice yo mi series El Rancho que está en YouTube. Uh, yo empecé la cuarentena con mis papás allá en el rancho y pues no estaba bien aburrida hasta la madre, güey. Y pues dije, santo Dios, ¿qué voy a hacer con mi vida? Y pues me la voy a pasar aquí todo Netflix en chill y todo así. Pues dije, ay no, mejor no. So agarré mi pinche cámara y dije, ¿sabes qué? Me voy a vestir como mi papá y voy a hacer puras tonterías. Y así nomás empecé y hice mi mamá reír. Y de ahí pues nomás las ideas crecieron y crecieron y pues... Me puse el tiro y nomás toqué la cámara y puse el go y dije, record, ok, vámonos, vámonos, let's do this. Y pues toda la magia siempre empieza cuando editas. El momento que editas, empiezas a editar, eso es cuando todo, pones todo junto y dices como like, wow, 